Hey everyone and welcome to another video. This time I have the Y7 2019 in front of me. Uh, in the, my previous video I compared it with the Redmi Mi Note 6 Pro and the phone gave a lot of competition to the Redmi Mi Note 6 Pro that I decided to give a full review of the Y7 2019. So we start off at the back. We're getting a dual camera setup on the back with AI functionality, a fingerprint reader, uh, this phone supports a plastic back, uh, which is prone to scratches. It's a low budget phone, so it's okay that Huawei included such uh, quality over here. You're getting a power button, the volume rocker buttons, and you're getting a SIM card tray, which can also be used to expand the storage memory. A USB port for charging and speaker grill on the bottom. A water drop notch on the front with a 6.2 inch screen. Uh, LCD screen that supports 720p resolution and the top uh, earpiece 8.1 out of the camera uh, the box Android version with 8.2 EMUI a 3GB RAM 32GB of internal storage that you can expand up to 512GB with the memory card and you're getting a 4000mAh battery you're getting a 13 megapixel camera plus 2 megapixel on the back. You're getting a 16 megapixel selfie camera on the front that can also be used to as a facial lock. One of the great things about Huawei nowadays is that for a smartphone that is very low budgeted like this, a $200 smartphone, you're getting a lot of functions like uh, the facial lock, AI cameras and the fingerprint reader and top it off all uh, the speakers are also really great so it's a single speaker on the bottom but the speaker is super fast super good sorry and get it gets really loud and it's really good to see that a low budget phone having a great speaker a lot of consumers buying low budget smartphones do watch a lot of things on their phones they use it as a daily driver so once again, hats off to Huawei for putting a lot of features in this phone. Uh, the phone comes with a 4000 mAh battery. In my opinion, it has given, in my review device, it has given me around uh, two days of battery life uh, on a single charge. Uh, this is a newer device. Uh, the, my previous device, I was using it uh, for playing games, for taking camera, uh, for taking pictures, and still it gave me around 20% by the end of uh, two days so that was super good uh, also the phone does not come with any fast charging options uh, so we cannot blame Huawei for that as uh, right now it's a budgeted phone overall to conclude everything off it's a really good phone if you just seen the facial lock feature works really fast everything regarding this phone is good uh, though I would have uh, ask Huawei to include a casing or something just to protect this plastic back. Uh, th this is a newer phone. I got this last week and uh, a lot of scratches has started to pop up over here. Also, if you want, I will be giving this device for free as a giveaway if I touch 1000 subscribers by the end of March. So stay tuned. Also, keep subscribing to the video. Do tell what do you think about this phone in the comment section below and once again if you want this phone as a free giveaway all you need to do is subscribe to the channel make sure my subscribe count touches 1000 and by the end of March if it touches around 1000 subscribers I will be giving this mobile for free stay tuned and till next time bye bye